What's up everybody, this your girl Kelly with everything in between and on this video I'm talking about Omarosa baby Omarosa is beast mode When I tell you Omarosa is beast mode Y'all can think what y'all want Y'all can say she ain't black Y'all can say she a man Y'all can say what y'all want Omarosa is playing a game and she gonna win and she's winning I don't like the lady as far as the things that I've seen I couldn't hang with her more than three minutes She'd get, oh my gosh But I have to give credit where it's due. When I see game being run and it's run right, give it credit. Credit to the game, Amarosa. Because I'm going to tell you why she winning. She's winning because Amarosa knew what she was doing from the beginning, y'all. The problem with you guys is y'all think that Amarosa wants y'all approval. Y'all think Amarosa want to be embraced by the black community. She let it be known a long time ago, especially almost two years ago when the man got in office. She put it out there and showed everybody in, in all the black community how well she could shit in our face. So, with that being said, if you afterwards are thinking that she owes some kind of something to us, you should be ashamed of yourself, not her. Amarosa, they never cared. Amarosa, do y'all remember her in The Apprentice? She cut throat and she's probably, the, she is the elite mean girl. I mean, she's the elite mean girl of high school. Like, are you kidding me? Y'all problem is thinking that Omarosa cares and wants to be accepted. She had a game plan. I think the plan was already planned out before he got in office. I think their history goes back further than we all know. I think that she knew what she was working with when he got his presidency. I think she knew what she was working with before he got his presidency. I think Omarosa knew that that man was dumb. And I knew. I think Omarosa knew that she could get in there and get what she needed to get. And that was a book at the end. And I'm going to tell y'all something. When that man said he was running and then when Omarosa got on camp with him, I ain't going to lie. One of the things I thought. I said, Omarosa going to write a book. I swear to y'all, I thought that. I'm like, she going to write a book. Because why wouldn't she? Why wouldn't she write a book? Hell, if I was sweeping up the leaves in the yard, I'd write one. Can you imagine the stuff that that fool got going on? I, for all y'all Trump supporters, say what you want. I, I, he's a fool to me. That's just my, my right to say how I feel. But Omarosa is beast mode. And now I'm going to tell you how she's going to get rich off this. At least, even if it's not rich forever, she's going to get the money she need. Y'all know Omarosa knew he was going to be a one-term president. So with that being said, she had to look at the long term. She was like, okay, he only going to be in here four years, if that. So I got to figure out what am I going to do when that's over, okay? Because she also knew by the end of the four years, it probably wasn't going to end pretty. Ain't nobody wants, w w wanting to be associated with him. So therefore, what would anybody need her for? We already don't need her. So what would we need her after the fact that uh, President Trump or, you know, is in her life? especially the black community so with that being said she got in there she already knew she was gonna write a book the child probably had posted notes all under her desk of what people said and things that she saw i don't care if she did sign an nda it don't matter she knows because they weren't giving her much anyway now remember she was she was black y'all she was the one token black person in damn near the whole administration or whatever uh, besides sleepy eyes. So she knew damn well that she had to get what she could get because a lot of stuff wasn't coming her way. No way because they was not letting her in the inner, inner, inner circle. Okay. So she, what she did was she somehow got kicked out, which I would love to know more about that story. I'm sure it's not the way it really was reported. She supposedly got kicked out or whatever. Then she says she left kicking and screaming, blah, blah blah of course the dramatics that won't that make a good book so now all of a sudden she coming out with a book and she just supposedly said allegedly that uh being on uh being in his administration <laughs> and leaving the white house was like uh, being a free slave or being off a of plantation something to that effect girl bad she got nerve to talk about my ancestors in her in her shenanigans y'all now is she black she is you know what I'm saying? And for that, she has the same ancestry, you know. I'm sure she did. I don't know. Actually, I don't know Amarosa's uh, lineage. I don't know if she's 
uh american or if her parents are from another country i just don't know i don't care um but what i am gonna say is amarosa knew what she was doing she's writing a book she's on big brother she cries these fake ass tears because she's so distraught and the black people you know dumped on her after she shitted on us and so all of a sudden y'all amarosa is gonna write this book and i'm gonna tell you who's gonna buy it you're gonna have white women buy her book Black people not going to buy the book, but guess what? She don't care because she ain't thinking about us, that she don't need us. She is writing a book for white women that's nosy, that want to know more details about that White House, that want to know, did she going to admit that she might have screwed the man? Is they they want to know all the details. Those are the people that's going to buy the book. If you're a white woman, you know damn well you want to know about that book. If you're a black woman, you know damn well you don't. So... And a black man ain't going to want to know, and a white man ain't going to want to know. It's white women. So just keep in mind, I just want to make that video real quick. My two cents that Omarosa is playing out exactly the plan that she planned on playing out. She got that fool, the fool is in office, and she all up in his ass, and she played the game, and she knew she was going to write a book when she got in. Now she out, she own Big Brother, and now she got she going to make sales. Now it won't be a bestseller. But it will make enough money for her to, to have for a while till she figure out the next group of people or the next person she's going to shit on. So with that being said, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Hit the bell button so that you can get all of the notifications when I have another video. Peace and love, everybody. Take care.